Okay. Okay. We got it. Okay, your controls. All right. Thank you. I have the controls. Controls. All right. So uh, we're going to be departure, uh, departing one right four, departure to the southeast. Yep. And then and that's it. You got it. Okay. Peter, night traffic, Skyhawk 52 Charlie, uh, departing runway 4, uh, departure to the southeast, Peter O. Do you, uh, do you usually stop in the middle or do you just kind of go? Uh, it depends. You can just kind of keep rolling. Okay. We'll do, uh, we'll do the rolling takeoff this time. Yeah. Remember that wind's coming a little bit from the uh, from the right. right so, so we'll do a right. Uh... Yep, you got it. All right, here we go. Take off time. Okay. All right, we'll turn crosswind now. Okay. Peter and I traffic, Firehawk 5C Charlie is hitting crosswind, runway 4, Peter Rope. So we're getting ADSB altitude here, but not on here. Interesting. Not on the iPad. Or yeah, which is connected to the... Uh, the 345. All right, remember, pitch power trim. Pitch down, 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 down. Down, down, down. There we go. As well as, we're going to go into the Bravo. Yeah, I know. There we go. I always freaking do that. I might have distracted you. I apologize, but keep that nose down. Push, 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 push. Give yourself some trim. Bring that trim up. Bring that trim up. Up, 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 up. The other way, other way, other way. Up, 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 up. There you go. Make it easier on yourself. And then drop that power out all the way. Let this thing drop like a rock. Okay. Yeah. Just do a slip. Do a slip. We need to Alright. There we go. Yeah. If you see that we get too close to airspace that we shouldn't be getting too close to, make a change. Don't baby it, you know, make a change. Uh, because, especially when it comes to like Bravo airspace, you know, they might be, uh, might get in trouble, you know, whether it's you or whether it's me kind of thing, right? Yeah. And we were, you know, kind of flirting with it. Um, we were, huh? And maybe yeah, we had traffic, an uptrack. 41883, the Warrior overhead, 1500 northbound. Peter Knight traffic. Skyhawk 3552 Charlie's about three to the southeast and southeast bound final fall, Peter Knight. Um, Skyhawk traffic, second 133 second uniform, right cross on runway 4, Peter Knight. Maybe we had a, um, maybe we had an updraft. Do you hear us any better airborne? Yeah, I can, I can hear you real well here, and I was actually just noting, uh, I got your altitude on the, uh, 650, but not on my iPad. Okay, good enough, thanks. Wow. So anyway, yeah. So uh, if you see the airplane uh, is doing something that you don't want it to do, make the change to make it do what you want it to do, right? Yeah. If we, like I said, we might have had an updraft, and that's uh, a difficult thing, but if you're really having to push, yeah, traffic, uh, game of or if you're pushing and it's not doing what you want it to do, do something else to help you make it do what, it, what you want it to do. And unfortunately, the updrafts are going to be a challenge uh, 
throughout uh, summer. <laughs> yeah, but that, that's the type of weather that yep. they like to come out. Four one eight eight three is starting the uh, right teardrop. Uh, We're almost at uh, right. Peter on Mike, TVM 930 Delta, take off runway 4, Peter on Mike. Cool. That's tough. Man. That that was a little tricky. Okay. Well, um, when you are ready, okay. uh, whether you want to go to the north or south of the towers, doesn't really matter to me. Um, say out this way here. Okay. Yeah. Cool. So what we're going to do is we're going to go out this way here. We're going to have you, um, uh, if you want to climb up to a higher altitude, we could do that and practice a couple of steep turns. Okay. And then we'll drop down and do uh, some S turns and turns around a point. What do you think about that? I think that would be great. All right. Um, again, it's been a little bit, so I'd like to just, you know, practice that stuff. Yeah, that's fine, yep. So let's go up to like uh, 2,500 feet. 2,500. Yep. Traffic, uh, 883 is entering a left downwind for runway 4 of minutes. Hey, good afternoon, TVM 930 Delta 50 passing through 900 uh, to 1600, a couple of miles uh, east of Peter O'Night. You're still on Peter O'Night. Go to the TVM 930 Delta with you, passing through 1.2 up to 1.6, just a couple miles east of Peter and Lake. And you're still on Peter and I three, but you go to 19.9. <laughs> That's embarrassing. It's been a traffic, uh, 883 yeah. in front of the left base for We are human. Yes, we are. Yeah. Construction of runway 5. And Yeah, don't fly it with the trim. Push the nose, you know, just set your pitch for what you want. Set your power for what you want. 22 to 2300 RPMs, probably. And then use the trim to relieve the pressure. So you see how the nose pops up a little bit? Just keep that pressure in there. A little bit more pressure. Alright. There you go. That's, that's better. And look at that, right at 2500 feet. Good, 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 good. Very good. All right, cool. So let's um, let's kind of you know clear the area and do that. Do you remember S P E A C H? Um, let's uh, let, let's go over that together. No problem. Yep. Switches. Oh, the S P E A C H is our uh, pre maneuver checklist. So switches. We want to at least have probably beacon landing and strobes on. What do we got? Beacon landing and strobe. Okay, we can leave those on for okay. for the switches. Okay, if we had a low wing, we would turn on like an ox pump or a boost pump, you know, whatever. But we don't have to worry about that because uh, gravity is helping us get fuel to the engine. So, uh, switches are on. Power set. This is the, the steep turns is basically a cruise maneuver. So yes. we've got a good power setting. Um, uh, uh, SPE is an emergency yeah, landing, landing site. Yeah. Do, do you see a good area that would be we make be able to make an emergency landing? Not really, huh? Um, We're over a whole bunch of houses and stuff. Yeah, should we go out a little bit That's more? Fine. Maybe we can then go towards those fields over there. Yeah, let's do it. We'll so, all right. So we'll just keep going this way. Sure. That's fine. But we've got an idea of where we could, where there's, a, where there's an open area. Okay. So that's SPEA is our altitude, uh, 2,500 feet. So we're doing a great job with that. C is our clearing turns. Okay. So that'll be like 90 degrees to the left, 90 degrees back to the right. The reason why we like to start to the left is so that if anybody's coming behind us, they should 
to pass on the right. So this way we don't turn into them, right? Got it. So we'll turn. Always left. Yep, we we look left. Kind of raise the wing, make sure everything looks like it's good right there, right? Yes, and it then does. Look left, turn left. So go ahead and go. And so you're looking out your window, I'm looking out my window. We're looking for any birds, towers, Fantastic. airplanes, uh, etc. cetera. 41883 is uh, turning a left cross front for one way five minutes. And I'm not seeing anybody with any five mile ring of us on the, uh, the Avionics uh, here. Descending out of uh, 4,600, any traffic please advise. Okay. okay, cool. And then let's go ahead and come back yeah, to the right. All right, so right wing is already up. Everything's yeah. good. And then we'll go over to the right. That's right. Left down with the side. All right, cool. So having done our clearing turns, SPEAC, we can do our H heading bug. So heading bug is going to be somewhere right around probably east. Left down wind for one way five. We'll be touch and go to If you want to, you know, set your heading bug for uh, for this heading. For this one right here? Yeah. So what's our heading? Uh, right now it's 120. Really? No. So it looks like we may need to adjust this, right? Yeah. I've been wondering if this thing is not uh, 100%. That's that's pretty accurate, right? Yeah. It looks okay. like good enough for government work? Yeah. I so see. in level unaccelerated flight, this is what we kind of look for. You know, it, that's when we can set that. If we're climbing, turning, or descending, kind of thing, we wouldn't want to be adjusting our uh, our DG. But um, all right, so if your heading bug is set, and you're happy with it. We've cleared the area. We could. We're definitely within gliding distance of all these fields right here now. So oh, yeah. now we can go ahead. When you're ready, go into a 45 degree turn to the left. Okay. Go 360 degrees, and then we'll do one to the right. Okay. Uh, I would just like to just talk about it first before I do sure, it. Sure. No problem. Um, pretty much, we're just gonna. Pitch to the left, uh, 45 degrees, and yep. then... Uh, Which will be kind of halfway between those two lines right there. This is um, 15... No, no, 10, 20, 30, 30. and then 60. So That's just right. kind of go halfway between those two okay. bigger lines. And then uh, usually it's like maybe two two, two or three of these guys. Yeah, and then we'll, a, uh, a, squ a smidgen of power, if you will. So you hear the RPMs rise yep. as you're rolling into the turn. And okay. um, we've descended a little bit. Yes, we have. So just let, it get, let the airplane fly. Uh, let it see if it'll fly back up to 25. Remember, you got to trim to fly, you know, a certain airspeed and ideally at a certain altitude. So, if you're having to like push on it a lot or whatever, then you're having to fight it. Most of the flying an airplane is not about manhandling the airplane, but getting the airplane to do exactly what you want it to do. Right. Is, uh, in a midfield. Sometimes I just left down from runway five. I am in control, not the airplane. Right. Cool. And if you want to do the maneuver at 24, I'm okay with that. I All just right. picked a, a number, you know, so. But anyway, yeah, so whenever. But this is looking good. Does it feel good? It does. Yeah. Two nine traffic, two nine, two nine or Lima, thirty one forty five downwind, only four. Peter nine traffic. Trying to keep an eye on the VSI just a little bit as I do this. Right. <laughs> All right. Cool. And then you can work that power, work that trim. Okay. Uh, what are you doing down? Dude, dude, check it out. They're like almost. Ah, that almost completely symmetrical and everything. That 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 looks pretty good, actually. Yeah, it does. Yeah, looks... The first one was a little, oh a, a boy, a little lopsided, not too bad, whatever. But those are looking good right there, nice and smooth. Okay, they're that's... they're kind of ovalish because the wind is pushing on us a little bit. You know, that's okay. gonna happen. But when you got them symmetrical like that, it's like that's pretty much yeah, it. Yeah, man, that's that's awesome. Cool. All right. All right, what else you want to do now? Do you want to go ahead and do uh, uh, S turn to turn around a point? Drop down a little bit lower? I, I think I think that would be good. All right, let's do it. Okay. So, um, go ahead and turn me to the south. Two nine in Lima, turning base four. While uh, descending? Yeah. Okay. Oh, what am I doing? Uh, a thousand? Yeah, go down to about a thousand feet. Okay. And uh, in the meantime, where do you think the wind's coming from? Uh, let me see here. Uh, 
don't, I, I, I don't have any. There's not a lot to work with, is there? No, man. Yeah, there's a little bit of smoke coming off that plant. And uh, I think the winds are kind of coming out of the east. Because it looks like we're getting blown this way. Yeah, actually, okay. you're right. So if we're, winds are coming out of the east, we want a road that goes north and south to do the S-turns. Okay. All right, or a tree line or something. So if you want to do that one first, or if you want to do S-turn, I'm assuming it turns around a point, we'll want to have, again, a west track for the beginning of the maneuver. Um... Yeah, so if it's if it's coming from the from the east, right? We want a downwind, right? So let's turn and go to the west. Okay. All right, so we're at right 1900 now. Yep. Right traffic, from we forward. Back into the VOB Alpha Bravo. Turn right traffic. Cool. So this will give us. Our, uh, our downwind, and now if we cross over a road or a tree line that's long enough or something like that, something that we can use as a reference for our S-turns, uh, then you can just kind of like roll right into the maneuver, pretty much. This is true. I've been, I've been looking for traffic the whole time, and I'm not seeing anything. I'm keeping uh, my eye on a thousand there. All right. we're, we're getting close. You don't have traffic check on three tango uniform. Right down wind for zero. Oh, traffic pattern work? Yeah. Zero traffic banana. That's uh, Danielle and Dave, and they're doing the uh, technical checkout for her. Good. So she can then instruct students in that plane. Right. Uh, we do have a we do have a small road coming up here. Okay, if you think you can make it work, let's you try it. You see it right down here? I do. Yeah, it's kind of a it's kind of a smaller. Let's, let's small, try it. Yeah, let's let's go to shot. We're at eleven hundred, right. so. All right, so squeeze a little bit of power in there so we can stop that descent. Let's not go a hundred knots and just trim up a little bit. And when you're ready, let's see what you got. All right. Uh, a little low on power there. That's fine. Make the change. Yep. Uh, a, a little, a little too soon on that one. Uh, maybe just a hair too soon, but that wasn't too bad. Yeah. Try on the left side. All right, top touch on three tango uniform final four. Uh, see, this one I feel like I cut, I cut way too, way closer to the to the road. Yeah, yeah. yeah. All right, cool. Let's just do this here. Keep swinging it around. Sure. And just make it into a 360 degree turn. Okay. So, okay. Yep. So we'll kind of be going back into the wind upon the completion of this turn. So think about, again, steep, medium, shallow, shallow, medium, steep. It's not that you know the turn has to be real steep. Okay, because that road goes a long ways out this way here. Okay, so we'll kind of keep it coming, does. keep coming around this way here. On your when you're on the uh, the downwind side, you know, like you're, you're coming yeah, with the wind, right? Yeah, yeah. it's, it's going to be final, steep. And when I say steep, I mean maybe 30 degrees. It's not going to be real super steep. It's not like 45 degrees a turn. Okay, right. I mean you could if you really wanted to, but that's uh. not what we're aiming for. It's just going to be the steepest point of the turn. Okay, the medium, I don't know, 20 degrees. Shallow, five degrees. I don't know. It's somewhere you know. You kind of gotta. It's it's almost not even about holding a, a, a bank heading. It's about just kind of knowing that okay, I need to go kind of from a steep to a medium to a shallow as I progress through the turn. Okay. And then the opposite is the same true. It's shallow, medium, steep as you're on going into the wind side. So, all right, let's go ahead and turn around and have you start it again. All right. Only this time we'll start to the left. We're gonna start to the left this yeah. time. All right. Cool. Well, that way we've got more road, you know. Sure.
I definitely feel like I've I've relaxed a bit more since good. I first started. Good, good. I, I don't know if you remember, but I always I always was was looking inside a lot. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, you 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 definitely have a better scan on all the instruments and stuff. So you're doing great. Yeah. All right, so here we go again. Okay, cool. We're at the thousand. So we're trim level. Is it? Does it feel like it's pretty good? You having a push pull or anything? Uh, I got to trim down a little bit. That feels all right. Perfect. Good. good. All right, going left. Yeah. All so right. making sure it's clear left. Yeah. All right. Cool. Okay. Over uh, the road. Over the road. Here so we go. kind of steep. You know, not you know super crazy. Yeah, like that right there. Cool. There go. And then look outside. You know, think about how your turn is progressing. Yep, this is a ground reference maneuver, not an instrument maneuver. So looking inside is, you know, helpful from time to time, but doesn't don't you know do the maneuver inside the airplane. Got it. Just kind of judge how much bank you need, kind of get you where you need to be. Now you see this shallow bank? Yeah. This is what we need to have here. I mean, just ever so slightly, you know, because we need to get that distance that we had on that side on this side. Right. And that was like probably out, out this okay, way. Okay, right. And so you can see how doing the turns around a point, remember we got those four points you kind of fly over. Yeah. That kind of translates to this. You kind of know what your distance needs to be uh, on this side. I feel like this is a bit more even than, it the, is. than, the, than the first one. And, we'll and again, we don't have to go crazy steep, but it's just steep, uh, steep and mean or whatever, so that we come right back over the road. Oh man, this is beautiful. Look at that altitude. All right. Uh, uh, maybe you roll out uh, just a little, her uh, just a hair early, but you know, that's all right. I'll okay. take it. I'll take it. You want to do it another one? Uh, I w uh, yeah, let's, let's do right, another do one. It. I'm going to do a, a 180. That's and then, fine. Yeah. So if you do the 180 and you're going to be facing into the wind, what are you going to start with? Uh, in, uh, are you going to start with a steep or a shallow? Into the wind is, is uh, shallow. Yeah. Yeah. So it would be shallow, medium, steep, steep, medium, shallow as you continue through that. All right. This This is just a... A turn here. This yeah, yeah, yeah. No, you're fine. I understand 100%. We did gain a little bit of altitude. Yeah, uh, yeah. So if you want to lose it, drop a little bit of power. If you're at 1,100 feet when you do the maneuver, that's fine too. You know. Yeah. Well. All right, I think we'll go ahead and start start getting ready. All right. Let's just again go to the uh, go to the left. Go to the left. All right, yep. here we go. Yeah, we'll carry traffic on five six sixty two about six miles southwest of the airport. It's just short. Uh, it's okay. just it's a little bit outside. Airport, it's my time, my time. Think about where you're going to fly over. How the distance is going to look. Yeah. Looking outside also helps you keep a scan for birds and air their airplanes and towers, all that kind of stuff.
So yeah, just this little bit of bank, that's what we're gonna have on the other side. Cool. Okay. And we're gonna go nice yep, and shallow at nice the beginning. Shallow, yep. Just a little bit. Think about the distance that you want, you know, out this way here. You can really yep. feel like you can feel the when wind, you, when right? When you get pushed and it's like, all right, it's yeah, kinda, it, this it, is, it start, it you starts. You know, going. this is when you need to start exactly. Awesome. Right. Cool. Not, no, that felt good, right? Not too bad. Hey, I remember this place. You do. This is where we we where we did our first uh, turns around the point up here. Okay. Well, you want to try it again? Yeah. Let's this, do it. This is almost this literally is, perfect. This is perfect. So, what is going to be your point? Um, okay, so there's there's a tree. A uh, lonesome tree. A huh? lonesome tree. There's like okay. a, a little ditch with water uh -huh. running, uh, pair, um, you know, yeah, w yeah. with us. And then there's a tree to the right to the left of it. Okay. How about you see? You see right, which one? right to the left. I understood. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> yeah. So position yourself whatever distance you want from that tree. Okay. Comanche 6056 pop us up one across the runway one, Everness. And then think again, once you're a beam it, think about your distance from that tree. And draw a line to whatever straight out from it. We're about four miles to the west and bound for a landing runway nine, Crystal River. All right, so ten fifty. Let's remember, bring the maybe bring the, the pitch up a little bit, spell back a little bit, just because we don't want to be going too fast. At the start of the maneuver. Right. Yeah. All right, cool. Whenever you're ready. All right, we're almost there. At 21. All right. Now look outside and fly your, your head, oh. or fly your references. <laughs> That's just the wind. Yeah. yeah. Crystal River traffic in the carrying 94. 2 and 2, we're on a 5 mile final for oh, one way down or Crystal River. You got the traffic landing. Keep it coordinated, yep. Yeah. Alright. Gunning traffic, Cardinal 321 for Yankee is departing the pattern to the east. Okay, so that was steep, medium, shallow, right? Uh -huh. So now shallow, medium, steep again on this side. All right, Chris River traffic, two carrying nine four two one two. We're on a three mile final. Yep. Start of the maneuver. Uh, kind of out over the trees. Okay, there. so make that turn. Don't don't go level. Oh, yep. Yeah. I just <laughs> yeah, I just messed that up. Damn it. You're fine. No, no, you're good. Just keep doing. Keep going. And what heading are you going to end on? Uh, the west. How about west. Yep. Yeah. So just kind of end exit that maneuver. Yeah. Dude. Dude. I don't know, that's not perfect. That is like as perfect as they come, man. The, the, I, I think it was the last time we flew, we, we practiced these. That is like, and, uh, yeah. Th th like, there you go, that's it. That's like done, sign them up, you know? <laughs> All right. So, yeah. Are you, I mean, are, are you happy with I'm, that? I'm, I'm very happy with that. Okay. You said, like you said, you haven't flown in, like, what, a month and a half, almost two months? Almost two. So to come out here and just bang out one uh, turned around a point like that? Okay. I'd say that's a sealed deal. Cool, man. All right. That, that makes me happy. Good. I'm glad to hear that. Let's uh, let's go back to Peter O. Okay. What do you say? Or we, unless you want to practice something else, we could, uh, we could do a... A little bit of slow flight, I guess, if you want. Yeah, let, let's do okay, just yeah, a little think, bit of slow flight, uh, maybe, since we're kind of on our way back. Sure, take yeah. me up to 2,500 feet. Okay, sure. 
And then, uh, wait, we're going, we're going away. Okay. Yep, you're west. fine. Just get a, let's get a VY climb, 74 knots. Climb up to 2,500 feet. We'll just go west for right now. 74 knots. And get yourself a little bit of trim when you get to 74, too. Okay. Uh, that's hanging out right around 74, 75 ish. Works for me. And I need the use right rudder. Keep the plane straight. There we right. Go. Nicely done. And There's 1500. When you get to 2,000 feet, go ahead and initiate a turn to the north. Okay. Oh, what am I doing? 09 traffic, Cincinnati, stairs right downwind, runway 4, Peter 09. Get to uh, 2,500 feet and kind of like north heading. Yeah. Kind of level it off. Pitch power trim. Okay. Right. Yeah. Let it keep climbing. Let it let it climb up. Sorry. If it wants to get to 74, you know, let it fly at 74. You can generally speaking take about 10% of your climb rate. So we're getting about 700 feet per minute. So about 70 feet okay. prior to. You can start your pitch power and trim. Two left coming. One with one zero. Shutter burn. All right. Here. Push those forward. Crystal River, 323, turning one o'clock, Crystal River. Set your trim, look at that, 2,500 feet, right on point. All right, oh, All right. oh, oh. Get that trim. I keep getting them, like, backwards. I know, up is down and down is up, yeah. right? Yeah, come on, man. Think about which way you want to push the nose. You want to push the nose down so you're going to pull it up and down. There we go, I like that. Or you're pulling the tail up, however you want to, you know, speak it to yourself. Still wants to go up a little bit. All right, all right. So if you get it pretty close and then you got a little bit of a climb, you can always adjust the power a little bit. But I think yeah. you got it probably kind of where you need to be. Okay. All right, let's do slow flight with full flaps. All right. So we're gonna bring the power back. Yep. And if we want to try and maintain, let's see if we can maintain 2,600 feet. So bring the power back. Let the nose drop some. Yep. Kind of get back down to 2,600 feet. Okay, and then put in the first notch of flaps. Yep, we're under 110, we can do that. As long as we're under 85 knots, then we can put in the second notch of flaps. 85. Okay. 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 Let's go for it. Let's go for it. Let's go for it. As long as it's feeling stabilized and you're still under 85, second, or sorry, third notch of flaps. Cool. Now bring your power up to about 2,000 RPMs. My guess is you're going to need about 2,000 to maintain your altitude. Remember, pitch for airspeed, power for altitude. Let the nose come up just a little bit more. Let's get about between 50 to 55 knots. Oh, yeah. Cool. And then see if you can get it trimmed. Okay, traffic number 53260 is now. Yeah, a lot of left. A lot of right. You need a lot of right. Look at your uh, your ball over there. Oh, jeez. There you go. You can kind of bring the wings level, Sorry. and it'll kind of help. There you go. Get this thing trimmed. We don't want the nose down. Ah. Okay. Remember, pull the nose up for okay. your airspeed. So we're going about 60 knots, right? All right. Get about 50. 50 to 55. And then whatever pressure you feel like you need to kind of Zero get it to do what it needs to do, that's what you want to trim for. Cool. And we may have a slight climb, so reduce power just a little bit. Okay, we'll cut this off by 662, turning back across. So how does it, 
that feels pretty good, doesn't it? Yeah. And the airplane, it may fluctuate a little bit in airspeed, but that's okay, because it's going to get back to where it needs to be. It's going to kind of do one of these things here, kind of, you know, work its way into it. All right, go ahead and turn me uh, just nice and easy. Uh, turn to the right to a heading of east. Yeah, just about 10 degrees of bank only. Wow, the, the difference in handling is... Right. It, it's, I, it's I feel much... like it's just like sliding like, yeah. like this yeah. in the air. Yep. Yeah, that nose came up if it wants to. Or we've told it to be trimmed and to fly about 58 or 50 knots. Cool. You have a ground speed of 41 knots now. <laughs> Just try and keep it going towards the east. Keep oh, that nose sorry. up. Okay. And when you're ready, let's do a uh, turn back to the north. The north. Yep. Yeah, looking at my window, we're not moving very fast, are we? No, no we're not. Alright, no. cool. Let's All right, turn it back. back. Yep. Cool. I, Because I, we're going so slow, I feel like we're just like drifting right Pretty now. Pretty much. Yeah. It's, 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 it's and good Everness to... traffic, Comanche 6056, yeah. pop turning down one runway one, Everness. Yep. All right, cool. Let's uh, let's reduce power. Re reduce power? Yeah, bring power all, like, all the way out. All the way? All the way. Like idle? All, like idle. What do I... Like that, yeah. Like awesome. <laughs> and look at what's going to happen. We're going to descend. Yeah. Right? Okay. Now watch this. Bring the nose up a little bit. Rock area traffic, November 6th, 1-3, Fox, Rock, Tango, on Mid-River, Bring it up. 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 Don't, don't do this here. Just rudder. Just rudder. Okay. And, like this right here. Okay. Yeah, like it breaks. Oh. Now full power. Full power. Full power. Full power. And push the nose forward. Congratulations, you just did a power off stall. That was, oh man. <laughs> <laughs> All, right, All right, so so you got full power in there? Yeah. No, you don't. No, I don't. Sorry. There it is. Okay, cool. So we cram, we climb, we get a, ourselves a, a positive rate of climb. We clean up, so bring up one notch of flaps. Okay, cool. Let the nose you know drop a little bit. Yeah. We just make sure our airspeed's good. We still got a positive rate of climb. Another notch of flaps. Ten. And... When you're ready, the last notch of flaps. Cool. Wow. Awesome. All right, so when you're ready, let's turn out to the uh, the Hoosierman website out here. Right. The east, yeah. And let's descend down to 1,000 feet. Yeah. So turning to the east and descending. Yeah, let's do a, a, tur a turning descent, you know. Yeah. So chop that power. There you go. Yeah, chop and drop. Cool. And when you're when you're ready, and you want to plug into the GPS to go to direct Peter O, yeah, go for it. Okay, I'm uh, gonna watch my descent. That's and fine. I'm gonna try to do all this. Yeah, just when you're ready, you know. Yeah. Yeah. It automatically suggests something based off of putting in just a little bit of information. All right, so we have traffic. We do. So what do you want to do? Uh, well, we are... I want to turn uh, to the... What are we doing? To the south? Oh, here, let's turn Let's turn to the north, actually. What? Let's turn to the north. Uh, north? Okay. Yeah. We'll go in behind him. Oh, okay. While, while we're still descending, because we we're, we're at, we're at yep. 1,800. And He's below us, so he technically has right of way. Got it. So we'll descend and go behind him. Okay. Because I have a feeling he's going to Peter O. Yeah. I could be wrong, but... 
So he's. Yeah, I don't want to look over there. Chris River traffic bonanza five to the northeast. I'm going to enter a midfield left downwind niner full stop. Chris the river. All right, so um, let's get the weather at Peter O. Yeah, very good. Uh, One eighteen. Thousand broken temperature three four Celsius dew point one eight altimeter three zero zero niner remarks density altitude two thousand one hundred. Okay. Yeah. Tampa Peter O Knight Airport. Automated weather observation two zero three niner Zulu weather wind zero seven zero at one two visibility one nice. zero yeah. ceiling okay. seven thousand. All right. So cool. zero seven zero at one knot. So we'll we'll land runway four. All right. Uh, three zero zero nine. I already set it on the altimeter. Cool. Um, we are. Uh, what, what you want me to to uh, level off at a thousand? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And look at our distance. All right. Ten and a half. Yeah. Okay. So, so level so off at a thousand. So aviate, navigate, communicate, right? So we, yes. we fly the airplane first, then you can kind of turn whichever way you want to go, and then you can call Peter O and let them know what we're going to do. Okay. Um, so it's... All right, so we're at, we're at 1,000. Yep. Uh, we're approximately 10 miles to the to the east. That is correct. Uh, um, we are inbound for the 45-degree uh, entry to downwind for runway 4. Got it. Peter, okay. Peter and I traffic Skyhawk uh, 5 2 Charlie. We are approximately 10 miles to the east, uh, inbound for the 45 degree entry to the downwind runway for Peter O. Perfect. Okay. And now we're going to go ahead and turn. Peter and I traffic Commander 7 3 Golf is 5 miles to the south east, inbound the land, runway 4. Okay. And he doesn't really know where he is. Okay. Alright, so we're at 1,000. Heading towards Peter O. Cool. Um, so let's go watch this direct oh. and activate again since we've turned this way here. And we'll just track straight towards Peter O tonight this time. Okay. Good. Yep. And I'm going to I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk a little bit just so you can kind of hear what, what I'm thinking in my mind, right? Okay. All right. Let me hear. So, runway 4 is what we're going to use. That means the downwind is 220. Yes. Plus 45 because we're going to enter on the 45 degree entry. So 220 is this way. 240, uh, uh, 265 is going to be our our heading, right? Yeah. Look at this. 267. Oh, so we are on an extended. We are on an like a eight and a half mile 45 degree entry. All How right. cool is that? That's all right. Watch it out too a little bit. Yeah. Yep. I go up. I power up a little bit. Peter Knight traffic. Commander seven three golf right down one four. Runway four. Okay, so he's gonna get there before us. Oh yeah, that yeah. was the other guy that we saw. He goes a little bit faster, retractable gear and all that kind of stuff too. But yeah. I feel like this was this was a good lesson, man. Thank you. Good. I think it was a good one too. Yep. The next one I believe is June fourth. Okay. Somewhere around there. So. All right. I think I have two, maybe two in June, two in July. So. Okay. Uh, you know, we'll we'll talk about it when yep. we when we yep. get down there. What I would say, have time, or you know, we we don't have to worry about it on the uh, on the base. Don't turn in. No, nope. oh, just kind of keep like this right okay. here. Yep. Cool. And in, right about now, turn your base and make your okay. call. Peter and I traffic Skyhawk five C Charlie is turning base runway four Peter O. All right, as long as we're under one ten, go ahead and put that first notch of flaps. Under one ten, yes yeah. sir. Cool. Those will pop up a little bit. If we get under 85, then you can put in your second notch of flaps. Okay. Uh, under eight. Cool. Okay, second now, notch. Now maybe you come in with a, just a hair of power. Just a smidgen, you know. Yep. Good. How's like that? that? That works. Okay. And I'll take over the controls, but I'll let you make the, the final radio call. Okay? You have the controls? I have the controls. Okay. All right, you ready to call final? Yep. Go for it. Peter Knight traffic, Skyhawk 5-2 Charlie, turning final, runway 4, uh, full stop, Peter O.
All right, cool. So we kind of walk it in like this right here. I'll drop final flaps. Bring the power out. There's that crosswind. Uh, so Peter, that you got a helicopter overhead, 1,000 feet southeastbound. Peter, anybody in a pan? I'll get the uh, nose, kind of get into ground effect, the nose up on the horizon. Kind of let it wait out. There we go. A little gust of wind picked us up again. Yeah, very good, sir. Thank you, thank you. Move, birdies. All right, cool. Do you see uh, Do you see how much pressure I still have in the yoke? Yes. Right, I haven't let go. Now I've let go. That's what I say about flying the airplane all the way down to the runway. Okay. You know, all the way to the tie down to me. Yes. Uh, Peter, and I traffic. Uh, helicopter's now clear to the southeast, 1,000 feet. Peter, out, buddy. Okay. Peter, and I traffic. Skyhawk 52 Charlie, clear of runway 4. Peter, out. All right, cool. Okay. I'll keep doing the taxi. I'll let you get Peter, and I traffic. Okay, Icon sure. is uh, 3 miles southeast over the water, 800 feet maneuvering. Flaps, uh, after landing, flaps up. Robes off. Landing taxi. Uh, mixture, uh, mixture, we'll do the finger. Yep. The, the, the finger tip. Okay. Uh, trim back to takeoff. Okay, and transponder. Okay. Cool. All right, you ready to taxi again? Yes, sir. All right, your controls. Uh, my controls. Your controls. So I turned and went this way because, and think of like a revolving uh, door. Go Traffic is going out to only uh, four. They're going to go that way. Yeah, so we want to... So this way we don't well, go nose to nose with them. We want to complete the circle. Yeah. Make it easier for them, easier for us. Yeah. Yourself, uh, for the icon of Peter. Oh, right. Do we have a, we have a spot down there? Yeah, we do. Yep. Uh, there's seven three golf. That's um. I think one of the last times that we that you and I flew together, they were actually like doing pattern work when we were taking uh, off. It's possible. Peter and I yellow helicopters over downtown. Following the canal to the south, we're gonna cross the departure line. The runway four seven hundred feet. Peter and I. Uh, what do you think? I think you're doing a great job. Cool. All right. Uh, Works for me. And then, uh, so before we shut down, uh, 12272, uh, what am I, 121.4, <laughs> sorry, I hit my head. Yeah, that's right, uh, yep, we're good there. No ELT. Right. Okay, avionics coming off. Okay. 